President and the Vice President Underground and out of here. Defend our base to the last minute. Investigate the supernatural map. Find out how the research gave one of the soldiers' powers and the reason why our attack neutralized those powers. The knowledge will prove useful in making our troops more powerful. My forces will continue pushing and eliminating their remaining forces. Understood. Listen up. Steinbeck and Horish is leading an assault on our base and have reached our supernatural map. I'm going in to try and stop them. Get back here as soon as possible. Understood. We're moving as fast as we can. We need to regroup. Let's move. Don't have much time. Damn it! They took out General Brown. The casualties are high too. This is the fight of our lives. It's do or die, and we need to get moving. General Moore, General Brown is dead. We've lost many of our other soldiers as well. Damn it! We need to make good use of our remaining forces. Fight to the end. My fury, we successfully eliminated one of their generals in the lab. Excellent bro. Their strongest arm force my slave. If we can break through, victory is ours. Understood. to clean up. We have a fog news breaking report. The United States of America collapsed today, with the American Empire becoming the dominant American faction following the secession crisis. Their successful attack on the U.S.'s last stronghold killed President Brewer and Vice President Odell, who ran the country using emergency powers following the siege of Washington, D.C. due to being the last surviving members of the United States government. Hans Steinbeck, the leader of the American Empire and D. Volksparteiter Gerechtigkeit, spoke today following his faction's victory. My citizens, today is a momentous day in all the need to purify the nation. Since we first seceded, we've known that the old United States Republic was weak and heavily flawed. With our victory today further reinforcing the depleted in war. Together, we will continue to clean up our nation, eliminate all the inferior so-called people holding us back, and tighten up our ranks to ensure no one can oppose our good cause. We will have a stronger nation once more. Breaking news. 
The worker states, the Confederate States, and the American Empire have agreed to a ceasefire. The ceasefire ends the violence instigated by each faction's decision to secede from the now-defunct United States of America, though whether the peace will last remains to be seen. Each faction seceded for various ideological reasons, and with the irreconcilable differences between them, they will likely use the ceasefire to replenish lost resources before going back into armed conflict with each other. This is the culmination of America's growing divide, and it's unclear whether anyone in the once united country can ever see eye to eye again. Chief Marshal Horoshus, the gas chambers are ready. It's time to start the purification process. Go and good fire them and start bringing the interior of Berlin we need to exterminate here. At last, we can clean up our footballer. Understood.